to Wednesday's Tarot. This is your tarot forecast for June 25th to July 2nd. My name is Brooke and this is the reading for Pisces. Hi Pisces, I hope you had a great week this week. And I'm doing something new this week Pisces. I had a viewer ask me to show the cards when I'm doing your reading. So I situated the camera so you can see me and good old Albert and you can see me shuffle your cards as well and lay them out. So this is what we're gonna try this week and it gives you, the viewer, much comfort as well as me, the reader, much comfort knowing that your reading is done with good intentions. So let's get started, Pisces, and see what's happening for you this week. All right, Pisces, let's check it out. Okay, Pisces, when I do your reading for the week, I do a seven card spread for seven days. Now, I do not read each card for each day, like one card's for Wednesday, one card's for Thursday, one card's for Friday and such. I do a seven card spread. I take a look over of your cards and gather a basic knowledge of what they're saying. And then the, your spread, the cards, will thread together symbolically to depict your storyline for the week. Okay? So Pisces, for many of you, you may have been feeling, this is kick-started off your week, you have the Three of Swords, and this is a card of feeling sad about something, kind of some heartbreak about a situation, some disappointment about something in your lives. For some of you Pisceans out there, these feelings may be felt for you this week. However, you do have an ace, and this is the Ace of Pentacles, and this is a wonderful card for new beginnings and finance. Uh, for some of you Pisceans out there, this may be a, a really great new beginning for a new job. If some Pisceans are looking for employment, this is also a wonderful new beginning for your finances to be looking up, okay? wonderful new beginnings in your financial sector for this week Pisceans it's very wonderful to have and for some of you Pisceans you may have been feeling like you've been waiting for something okay and this is the two of wands and wands are fire energy cards the two of wands however is a period of waiting so your wait is coming to an end. Something that may have been causing you some disappointment or sadness, you've been waiting for something, is going to change. You do have a wonderfully major arcana card. This is the Wheel of Fortune. The Wheel of Fortune is all about the tide is turning. Your luck is looking up. You have good luck on your side this week Pisceans, not only for the next week, but in the next month as well. So the Wheel of Fortune is all about luck. It's a stroke of luck, a windfall of some kind. It's a really positive card to have. Now Pisceans, for some of you, you may have felt that you have really struggled with something. There's been some, like I stated, some form of uh, disappointment or something to do with whatever. I don't think it's a love situation. I think this is more of career-wise or financial-wise. Next to this card is the Devil card. This card has come up for other signs as well. This is the card about really sex, drugs, and rock and roll. 
For some of you, you may have turned to excess uh, in drinking. You may have particip been participating uh, in addictions of some kind, maybe having too, too many glasses of wine, maybe indulging or escapism with food, alcohol, uh, could also pertain to a, a substance abuse, kind of being attached to your carnal desires, okay? Uh, but you may also be Pisceans dealing with somebody who may be chained to their desires as well. Now, what's very important to this is the card of the tower. What must come up must come down there's going to be an ultimate breakdown. When somebody hits rock bottom, they hit rock bottom. When something new is about to begin, like in creation, everything is destroyed be before it could be started anew. So Pisceans, you have two strong major arcana cards that summarize your reading. And don't be alarmed by the devil and don't be alarmed by the tower. This is symbolic of things that need to be destroyed, that need to tumble down before they can begin anew again. So let's take a closer look. I'm going to clarify your spread and draw another card. I'm going to draw three because you have two major, one major arcana card and two minor arcana cards. The swords, which is, this is the two of swords, this is the seven of swords, and this is a major arcana card called the emperor. The two of swords is a situation where you may have felt or are feeling blindfolded to a situation, not sure how to proceed or react to it. The Seven of Swords is all about being aware of deception or someone may be lying to you about a situation. The Emperor speaks about authority, especially male energy. Something It may perhaps play out with something to do in a legal matter uh, may possibly law enforcement for some of you Pisceans you may be contacting an attorney but it also speaks about authority in a situation where you have control okay so for some Pisceans out there this week this is not talking about your reading is not about romance it's not about family it's more along the lines of yourself your personal life, speaking about you, yourself, where you have possibly been a little heartbroken about a situation, but there's a new beginning that's going to come on the horizon, especially for Pisceans out there that are looking for new jobs. The prospects of a new job being secured is very favorable. The period of waiting is coming to a close. The tide is turning with your Wheel of Fortune card. Very lucky card to have. There may be, for some of you, been fighting or involved in a situation or involved with a person who is kind of attached to their carnal desires or addictions. The Sex, Drug, and Rock and Roll card, just be aware of that. And the tower must fall. There's going to be a breakdown of some kind in order to rebuild again. So Pisceans, I hope this reading found you well. I hope it was also informative as well as educational about how I do your readings every week. I will be back in seven days. Have a great week, Pisceans, and don't be too despondent about your spread. It's more positive than negative, and sometimes the things that are hardest in life we have to overcome to get where we want to be that's just natural so enjoy your week Pisceans I'll be back in seven days and I'll speak with you soon